Hannah. So first off, let's talk about um, just how how have you guys come together so far this season? I think, I think this month has um, given us a lot of growth. We've learned a lot, um, not, not only about each other, but what we need to do as far as um, what kind of dynamics we need to have and what kind of um, the areas that we need to grow, areas that we're strong in. I think this month being away definitely has um, definitely helped us um, take an inventory, I guess, to what we have to grow through and um, what we have to get better at um, coming into conference. So, What do you think the strength is of this team? I think we all I think we all genuinely love each other and I think you know um, a lot of growth needs to be needs to happen in the pitching circle but they're so strong they're so young but they're so talented and obviously offensively there's always going to um, there's always going to be room for growth and defensively we've been pretty solid but I think um, building off of our team chemistry is really big for us. I think you said it at the start of the year how excited you were to go on the road for all these road trips but 14 games in, it's got to be nice to, to finally play at March Red Diamond. No, it's definitely nice to be home this week, and I definitely miss playing in front of our crowd in our stadium. It's so beautiful, and, um, you know, I always say that I've never played in a stadium like ours. It's so beautiful and has so much history, but I think definitely being away um, has helped us a lot in terms of what we need to um, kind of overcoming that. Sorry, I just messed up. Sorry. Um, but I think just overcoming. Um, our comfortability, but I think like being home, it's definitely exciting. Does that give you guys a real advantage when there's you know, a thousand fans? Yeah, definitely. Um, I love playing in Marjorie Diamond because it's so electric and it's just so different. The feel and the home and the history, um, that feeling is just so different. And I think um, everybody's excited to play home, especially the newcomers. Um, we always tell, the returners always tell them, like, you guys, playing in Marjorie Diamond is so different than playing anywhere else. And so I'm definitely excited. It's my favorite place to play. So I'm really excited. How do you teach them about playing at home? I mean, obviously, there's a couple girls that know it. They're familiar with it. But when there's a full crowd, whatever it is, Friday night, the lights are on. How do you teach them, like, this is what's about to happen? It's honestly hard to explain um, to them what exactly it feels like because I feel like in words you can't really describe what it feels like playing under the lights, playing at nighttime, and playing in front of that crowd on our field. Um, it's definitely hard to explain to them in words, like, what it feels like. You just have to see their faces when we get out there and when we play our song, when we all run out there. And when they play the song and it comes down to it, when our pitcher throws the first pitch, it's like, okay, this is what it's like to be here. It's cool. It's definitely special. It's different, so. And um, you guys competed with Tennessee. You guys down two, right, four two. Um, just tell us about how much, you know, playing those t types of teams, like those top teams in the nation will prepare you for the rest of the season. You know, I think, um, Playing against those teams definitely helps us for the rest of the season, you know, obviously opening up with um, teams like UCLA and Tennessee and stuff, and um, unfortunately we didn't play Washington, but I think playing against those teams definitely um, sets a bar high for us, and we show ourselves and we prove to ourselves what we can do against those teams. That way when we play in conference, it's like, okay, we got this, we've been here, we can do this. And playing against those teams and staying with Tennessee, Lung being able to stay with Tennessee, it definitely proves to us and shows to us that we can definitely win conference and we can do this thing. So. Is that kind of what you got to do, just get thrown to the wolves out there, kind of what Danielle has done? Yeah, freshman? yeah. I feel like sometimes that's kind of what you have to do. You have to show yourself and you have to you have to fight your way out of those types of situations. You have to fight your way out of the top 10 teams um, in order to show yourself that, like, that you have this talent, you're here for a reason, you can do this. So I think definitely um, being thrown with those teams, you'd learn how to fight your way out of those situations. And how much confidence do you have in a freshman, you know, pitcher like Danielle? Oh, so much confidence. I was actually telling um, our teammates against uh, our, the last game that we played, Danny was throwing her, her rise balls and her change-ups, and one of them, she struck a girl out, and we ran in, and I was like, I think I swung on that change-up, and I'm on defense. Like, I felt like I swung at that pitch. Um, you know, she has a lot of confidence in there, and she's so cool, calm, cool, and collected. And um, playing behind her is definitely fun because she throws these pitches, and people swing, and it's the craziest feeling when someone swings and misses, and you're just like, oh, yeah, that's my, that's my girl. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you.